Would you rather be laser beam or be the sexiest man alive? What's the difference? Good joke. We're doing a would you rather. I was going through some old laser beam videos. I was out of ideas. And I saw some would you rather videos. I remember they were always dumb and funny. And you guys always seem to like them. So let's do a throwback and do some would you rathers. I apologize if I've done some of these already. It's been like a year and a half. So uh, how about cut me some slack? Don't be mean. Don't bully me. 2017, you can't be mean anymore, bro. Would you rather dress like people from hundreds of years ago or dress like a person from the future? Um, a hundred years ago, people wore potato sacks and shit. They also didn't shower. But people from the future, they might not even exist. Because, like, North Korea is ready to bomb and shit. So, I'm going to go with potato sacks. Oh, what, people disagreed? Sounds like you haven't heard of Kim Jong-un. <laughs> Where did I take this question? It's potato sacks or death. I choose potato sacks. Would you rather have Sarah Palin be president or have Michelle Bachman be president? What year is it? What year is it? Seriously, are these all from five years ago? Uh, Sarah Palin. I'm a big fan of who's nailing Palin. Let's just say it's adult content. Oh, man. <laughs> you know what's funny? Today's current political climate, it really makes me wish for Sarah Palin to be back. Yeah, I'm going with Sarah. I can see Russia from my backyard, Palin. Oh, people disagree. You know what? You know what? This is an outrage. Ah, uh, would you rather know the exact time and place of your own death or know the exact time and place of death of everyone around you? <laughs> Screw everyone else. You can all die! Yeah, I'm assuming if I pick everyone else, I survive. I, I don't die. I don't know if that makes sense, but I'm going with it. Hey, Tanner, you're dying in a week! That sucks to be you, bitch. Uh, would you rather be deep sea diving and your oxygen tank runs out or be bungee jumping and have your cord snap? So I'm a certified diver. I don't dive because sharks are scary, but I'm technically like a certified diver. So I've been down the deep, the deep sea. It's terrifying. But when you do the class, they teach you, uh, you will crump. You will just... So now I'd like to bungee jump and have the cord snap because that's just quick. You just... You're like a banana. Yeah, I don't really like pain, so I'm going with one that's always quickest. And looks like people agreed. Yeah, I don't, I don't want to get crushed to death. And then, like, my body's just in the ocean for a whale to eat. Like, guys, guys, you bloody legends. I don't want to be whale poop. Do whales eat people? Surely whale sharks eat people. Uh, would you rather be immortal or die right now? <laughs> Look, you're thinking, easy, easy answer. Uh, let me let me ruin this question for you. So, you're thinking immortal. I live forever. That's way better than dying right now. But wait. Shut the fuck up. I'm not done. I swear, I love you guys, but you, you talk too much. So if you're immortal, you have to watch everyone you love die. Which who cares? Go to Buggery, family. Don't care. You watch people you love die over and over and over again until you have no more emotional feelings. That's only step one. You see the world end. You see the human race die out. The sun explodes. You see that. You feel that. You get, like, roasted. You drift through space for literally eternity. You think a laser beams video is boring? Oh, you will be wishing you had my entire YouTube catalog to watch as you drift through space. But no, there's no YouTube. There's no entertainment. You sit in space with your own mind for eternity. That's why you don't want to be immortal. I told you I was ruining the question for you. I'm sorry. I'd rather die right now. Just kill me, fam. Would you rather eat a five-course meal in front of ten starving children or steal the bucket from five Salvation Army Santas? Holy shit, is there a way for me to do both? <laughs> I would do both of these very happily. This might be the most offensive would you rather ever, but I'd do both. Because that, that's the laser beam way. You get two offensive options. Why not both, eh? I'm only jokingly a terrible person. Don't hate me. Um, screw starving children. Yep, that's my choice. Oh, God. Why do I hate income? Obviously, I'm only joking. I donate heaps of money to charity. Get off my ass. I donate to charity so I can make these jokes. I'm in the clear. Would you rather be lost in the woods at night or stuck in a haunted house? H okay, this time, how about none? I'm, an, I'm a huge pussy when it comes to scary stuff. I don't like horror games. I don't like horror movies. Not a fan of this question. I'll take being lost in the woods. 
Yeah, there's more places to run away. I'll take it. I'm not very athletic, but I am pretty quick. I reckon I could run away from a serial killer. Would you rather be nine cat or have the ability to make any rage face of your choice? Jesus! These memes are six years old. What year is it? Rage face? Nine cat? Are you serious, bro? What year is it? I swear to God. There's got to be an option to stab myself, surely. Where's the stab myself option? I'm not picking any. I'm, I'm skipping the question. Can't handle it. Would you rather a spouse with trees as arms or a spouse with alligator arms? Look, if I'm getting a spouse, I'm happy. So long as they love me, I'm good. Um, I'll take the one that doesn't eat me, thanks. Although alligators are pussies. They're not crocodiles. I'll, but I'll, I will take the trees as arms, because then you're helping the environment. They supply you with oxygen. You can set them on fire if you're cold and lost in the woods. I'm taking that. I'm taking the trees. I'm taking the trees. Would you rather be horribly and hopelessly depressed or have inescapable, overwhelming anxiety? What if you've already got both? Good game, I lost those. Uh, I'll take... I'll take... Uh, Anxiety, I guess. I don't know. Would you rather steal an elderly woman's purse or tell 10 orphans that Christmas is cancelled? If they're orphans, do they even have Christmas in the first place? Seriously though, Christmas is cancelled. I'm not saying that, I'm bleeping that. <laughs> I'm Australian. Oh, I'm a criminal. <laughs> I'll steal the purse. Would you rather watch an uninterrupted WNBA double header? Okay. Oh, dear Jesus. Whatever the other option is, I don't care what it is. Listen to Nickelback. Oh, that's okay. I'll, I'll listen to Nickelback. I don't care, man. Have you seen the WNBA? Oh, my God. It's no disrespect to women. Women's sports is sick. Women's MMA, women's tennis. But the WNBA has one person that can dunk. It is just not entertainment. I'm sorry. I'll show you what I would rather do than watch that WNBA doubleheader. Literally everything in the entire world. Would you rather be a US senator or be the US president? This is kind of unfair. I don't really have a choice, do I? I'm not qualified to be a senator. US president, though. Look, they hired a reality TV star. Next step, YouTubers. I'll be US president. Would you rather die by freezing in Antarctica or die by walking through the Sahara? I like this person's optimism. At least I get to see the penguins. <laughs> that is one positive to dying in Antarctica. I think freezing to death is better than dying of like dehydration. I don't know. I've never died. I can't tell you. Look, I'm a big fan of penguins. Here's one pooping on another penguin. They're my favorite animal. I'm going with death by freezing. People agree with me. People love penguins. What can you say? What are you going to get to see in the Sahara? Camels? Who gives a shit about camels? Would you rather shrink to one inch or grow to three stories? One inch? Well, that's an improvement. Uh, I, what, if I'm three stories, I literally can't do anything. One inch, I'd get stepped on. Three stories, I'd never be able to go inside, drive a car. I would have to eat an entire herd of buffalo just to feed my hunger. I don't know, this is interesting. Oh, I reckon I could grow to three stories just for fun. I'd be dead in a week, but it'd be pretty funny. Look, I'm gonna be honest. Some of these, like, uh, they're pointless questions. If you and your siblings are kidnapped, would you rather live and let your siblings die or die to save? your siblings who cares obviously i'm living what have they accomplished how many subscribers do you have exactly i am worth more i have a million subs i am more valuable as a person it's like if you have less than a million subs i'm more valuable than you that's just the honest truth i'm just kidding I would have picked the other one, but it's too late. I already committed to the joke. So you're all dead. You're done. All right. Well, I'm off to jail. Oh, shit. They're coming for me. You got to stop. I have a stop sign. I have a stop sign. You got to stop. Just a sec. I got to do my outro. So belt the bloody like button. Check out this video. I really did enjoy bringing Would You Rather back. It's a fun, stupid game. Today's Twitter shout out winner is Mr. Dan Man 7 Thanks for watching, Dan Man. You're a bloody legend. You're all a bunch of bloody legends. Thanks for hanging out. I appreciate it. I will see all you fellas later. And as always, cheers, fellas. Laser God. Laser beard. Laser face. Mate, drop the bass.